We get this question a lot. Should I waive my home inspection? We're facing multiple offers. This is a great house in a great neighborhood. We have to have this house. Should I waive my home inspection? My professional answer, every single time, every single time, is no. I don't think you should waive your home inspection. Why? Most people aren't buying a home to gut it, tear the studs, rebuild it, and then resell it. Most people, when they buy a house, they're going to live in it. Right? They're going to buy a house, you move your family in, you're going to live in it. When you buy a house, you buy everything that you can see and everything you can't see. So why would you waive a home inspection? Now, there might be times when you're like, you know what, like, listen, I don't care. I'm buying this house. My uncle's handy. My dad's handy. I don't need, I don't need an inspection. That's up to you. That's your prerogative. I'm never going to encourage you to waive that inspection. I'm just not. Here's why. I'm not an engineer. I'm not an electrician. I'm not a plumber. I'm not a roofer. I'm not a flooring guy. I'm not a painter. I'm not a drywaller. I'm not a landscaper. I'm not an HVAC guy. I'm none of those things. I'm a realtor. I sell houses. I help you find the house that you want to live in. That's my expertise. So I can't give you any of that advice on if you should or shouldn't based on my unprofessional opinion of what that wall looks like or what that roof looks like or how old the HVAC is or any of that information. I can't, I can't give you that professional information because I'm not a professional in that field. And most realtors aren't professionals in those fields. Most realtors are realtors. Most realtors sell houses. So should you ever waive your home inspection? My opinion, not unless you're gutting the entire thing and you don't care. But even then, I'm going to recommend you get an inspection. Because if you don't intend, listen, we work with a lot of investors. And we have investors that buy houses, take them down to the complete studs, put on additions, new roof, windows, everything. And yet, there was a time where a wall was bowing and we didn't see it. And that entire wall had to get rebuilt and cost thousands of dollars that wasn't budgeted for. If you got a home inspection, that might have been able to be found. They're not that expensive. Three, five, seven hundred dollars, depending on the size of the house, perhaps. It's an investment for you, which then gives you an owner's manual of everything that's going on in that house. The HVAC is X years old. The roof is X number of years old. The windows, the fireplace, the appliances. Soup to nuts, inside, outside, they're going to give a professional opinion of what's going on in the property. Way more than we can. So why would you not want that? Do yourself a favor. Spend the money now to save the money later. And worst case scenario, getting an inspection is going to allow you to then budget for those big ticket items and those big ticket repairs that you're going to have down the road in three and five years. So it's not sprung up on you. Getting an inspection is always the right call.